Here. First up at 11, Doc Antle, the owner of Myrtle Beach Safari and one of the stars of Netflix's Tiger King, appeared in federal court today in Florence. The FBI arrested Antle and an associate this past Friday for money laundering. Tonight, News 13's Jack Billu gives us a look at an alleged check cashing scheme outlined in newly unsealed documents. You need a system. A friend of mine had a couple great systems. According to a criminal complaint, that's what Doc Antle was recorded saying to a confidential informant after being asked to help launder money earned from helping immigrants enter the country illegally from Guatemala and Brazil. The FBI says the informant was referred to Antle by Bill Dallas, the owner of S&D General Contractors in Myrtle Beach. Dallas was also arrested Friday on money laundering charges. He was recorded telling the informant of Antle he wanted me to move cash, but he wanted to move millions. I was like, I can't do that. During one of their meetings, Antle was recorded warning the informant that the money had better be real, saying, if the money is counterfeit, then they'll come kill me. It will all be over if the money is counterfeit. Something explosive will happen. Antle allegedly told the informant he would act as a third party, but later reneged, offering to launder the cash through Myrtle Beach Safari and Sockesty Landscaping, a company owned by one of his employees, Andrew Sawyer, who was also arrested. I can just say I had extra tourists come today and start making deposits for extra tourists, Antle said. We're going to write you the check for two twenty nine, dollars and we're just going to say it's for construction. During three transactions from February to April, the informant allegedly gave Antle and Sawyer more than $500,000 in cash. According to the complaint, they took a cut of about $70,000 and wrote checks for the remainder, paid to a company created by the FBI. Antle and Sawyer's bond hearing is set for this Thursday. In Florence, Jack Billiou, News 13.